hey what's up guys I'm going to play some Gears of War 4 this is the new map which has been released in the March update it's not available to the public yet uh, unless you have the season pass like me of course um, and this is the map called Diner and as you can see there's a nice diner in here in the desert and it's one of the first um, new maps made by the coalition because all previous maps which were released were remakes from uh, Gears of War 3 maps or Gears of War 2 maps. There's some horde mode on hardcore by the way. Look at them hiding in the distance. Um, what I really like about this map is uh, in, inside the diner it's quite close. It's, uh, there's a lot of um, stuff in the diner so you can really go for the close quarter battles in there in versus multiplayer. It's not good for Horde by the way, the diner, being inside the diner because it's still relatively open due to the windows um, but yeah and outside here is better for Horde because they're coming from one side of course if you camp in one of the spawns um, Jesus, this thank you <laughs> Just wasting some bullets on that one there. Okay, let me deposit my power again. Always important, even though I don't have much power, but every little bit helps, of course. To keep the barriers running. Keep the defenses on. Let me plant my grenades. Create the little traps. Oh, Boltok ammo. Nice, nice, nice. Always nice to find some ammo for the Boltok. I really love the Boltok because it's just so powerful. The recoil is really bad on it, sure, but man, if you just fire slowly, if you have the time, the damage with this thing is just incredible. Oh, there's a drop shot. <laughs> All the splashing hats. Okay, let's take out the drop. Oh, nice, they're already gone. Oh no, oh, hands up. Oh shit, I saw that one coming. <laughs> that was why I was hiding in cover because. These hunters just one shot you with their thorn bows. Oh, stay over teammate. No, not a drop shot, no. These guys can always take a shitload of bullets as you can see. I mean that was a perfect active reload. Um <laughs> it still took several clips. Oh no, I wasted the boom shot there. Does that make a headshot? No, no, oh shit, no, never mind. <laughs> um, yeah, let me try to shoot the much loader. Shit. <laughs> oh, I just wasted this last two bullets of my boom shot. Okay, I'm going to have to get some ammo when they are dead. Uh, come on, come on, come on, guys. Let me get on the turret for a second. Okay, that one's dead. Run! We've only got 30 seconds before they spawn again, so we need to run. Run to the other side of the diner to get some ammo. We have to be careful not to pick up the power because the scout will pick it up. They will have a deposit bonus, so they can get a lot more power out of the power that's there. Ah, 10 more seconds, 9, 8, 7, 
six. No. I will have to go through the diner. It's a bit safer, as you can see here. It's a lot more co close quarters, as I said. But due to the, all the windows and them spawning all around you, it's still very dangerous. Oh, teammate, no! I'm coming for you. Ah, the positive power. They're gonna get it. Eat rockets. Holy shit. Some more spying the hammer of the one. Oh, it's the boss is already down. The Hammer of Dawn is very expensive in this game, but it's so worth it, man. If you get the Hammer of Dawn, you can clear almost an entire map if you're lucky. Oh, shit, I wasted the shot down. Die! Um, but yeah. The heavy class which I'm playing now can have mortars. I don't have the card equipped right now. Um, but I don't they're not as useful as the hammer of dawn. You don't get as many kills and the damage is a lot less. So I prefer the, the hammer of dawn when I'm the soldier. Get a little power. Um, let me try to find something useful. Wait, wow, it's a little bit slow. No, it's always nice shooting them much slower with a bolt dog on the face because then they stop shooting for a second. And as you can see, we're saving a bit of time here so that the, uh, the scout can pick up the power as always. Load of XP there, nice. Almost level 10 with the heavy. I've only got the soldier level 10, I believe. Um, the scout's level 9. I think my engineer is like 8. The sniper and the heavy are both 9, I think. So, yeah, still some progress to be made, but it takes some time, which is good. And of course, I mean, if I played Gears War only, I would have easily been there already. But, uh, as you can see uh, on my channel, I play a lot of games. So yeah, not not too many Gears War. I, I, I love doing it, but I tend to only play it just after the updates. Um, and it, I play a lot of the campaign, of course, because that's what I really like about Gears. Because the problem with a Horde mode is, you can't really play it. Unless you've got like hours and hours and hours of time. Because especially on hardcore difficulty it can easily take up to two hours to play uh, horde mode. So it's just a ridiculous amount of time you need to have. You can't just play it because you feel like it, like playing for ten minutes. The multiplayer in Gears is really good by the way, which is a thing which is obviously a lot faster than the than the horde mode, but I'm not really a PvP kind of person, like um I like it in Rainbow Six though, but just I don't know. I'm not very competitive to be honest. Just I don't care about being the best, I just I just wanna enjoy gaming, you know, I just wanna play a lot of games, learn the stories. And uh, have some fun with friends and co-op. Like uh, horde and horde mode is perfect for that. Okay, I need to get some ammo again. Oh, oh we still do the shot. Oh come on! Oh, at least I got one kill. Damn. I was hoping to get the dupe. Uh, the double there, but sadly not. Okay. Mm. Let's be careful and try to sneak around. Mm. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
thing we can do. Run! Oh shit. No! Oh my god, it's just awful. If you um, take the ammo before the round completes, you can instantly take more ammo to replenish your um, ammo, of course. Um, because it spawns after each wave. So I would have. I think I would have had a full boom shot. So five more bullets in there. Which would be really, really useful. Uh, my lancer is full though, so that's nice. And we've got the salvo, which now is really, really nice. It's not gonna last an entire wave, but it's gonna be really, really useful. Ah! Need to run! Come, come, come! Before they spawn! Now, um, if you want to play a horde 150, I highly recommend saving up these salvos for their later waves, like 30, 40 plus, because you're gonna really, really need them then. We've got like six, seven of them, something like that, saved up in these. Um, I think they call the weapon locker. Jeez, why do I forget all these names? <laughs> but yeah, it replants just the ammo of these rocket salvos and, and you can store like, if you upgrade it to the maximum, you can store up to four of them in there. I tend to use them only in the, the, bo the boss waves, the ones in the we weapon locker. But if the weapon lockers are full, um, and I find another rocket salvo like I just did, before this wave, then I'll just use it in the wave. Okay, then we post some more power. Oh, my demon's down. Alright. Oh, sorry. Okay. Oops, sorry. Oops, I'm standing in your way again. <laughs> Okay, let me plant some grenades. Uh, stay. Um, on the back of this board. Let's make sure the shepherd doesn't walk into it. Because that would, would be a waste of my grenade. Okay. Three more waves, we are almost there, we're doing good, we've got plenty of power. Um, let me make sure I've got enough ammo as well. Boom shot! Yep, nice. Okay, I saw some lancer here somewhere, as well. Um, here, yep, yeah, nice. To cover! can't see if I'm hitting my target. I didn't think so, otherwise I think he would have been dead already. Oh, I chopped. Oh, teammate, no! Let me save you! Oh, no, got a hit. No. Protect me, cactus! Oh, holy cactus, give me help! Let me just spray my lance a bit with these enemies. I really, really like my tricky lancer with the changing colors. I, I believe it's legendary skin, I'm not sure. 
Um, this has the lightning skin on my boom shot. I really, really like that one as well. I pretty much like all the animated skins because, oh, no, no, no. This looks cool when things are moving. Careful, teammate, careful! Yep, yeah, nice, he's dead. Here we are, final wave. We've got enough power for a lot of, um, I think like, seven Hammer of Dawn Stripes that my teammates is going to use. As you can see, scorching, the, scorching them from the air. That's Let me try to take out the drop shot. This is under the cover of the diner roof. He's not getting killed by the hammer of doom. Uh oh no 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 no. <laughs> I knew this was going to happen. I just saw the drop shot bullet coming. But I knew it just... When you're holding a heavy weapon like the salvo. You can't dodge very quickly so... I just knew it was too late. Oh shit. Almost done. Oh that was the last one. Oh my god. <laughs> that is the only problem with the rocket salvo and it not being a first person shooter. You can't really see if you're going to hit the, the item in front of you or not. Nice, we made it. So uh, I just blew myself up uh, accidentally. So yeah, these were some waves of the 1 to 50 on the horde. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, make sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you guys next time.